So we're gonna start, we're gonna start from guard, okay? And again, he's gonna be able to punch at me, so I'm gonna pull with my legs. And again, I want my arms inside, not outside and around, because he can still hit me from here. So I wanna always have my arms inside. One is gonna swim through, pinch, and then I grab his head, okay? The other one, I use my forearm on his bicep and my palm on his tricep, okay? So that he can't hit me here, okay? If possible now, I'm gonna shift, put my foot in his hip, and now I can pin it here, so this adds an extra layer, okay? Now, one of the most key things is gonna be my other leg. So once this foot's here, I'm gonna shift my butt to the outside, and I put my foot on that hip, and now I pinch my knee. This knee is gonna be on the back of his shoulder, okay? And I'm pulling him into me, and I'm pinching this knee down into me really, really tight, okay? If this gets lazy, or if I put my foot over here, all my pressure is here, and not on my knee, and he's able to get up, okay? Yep, so I need to have my foot on the same side so that I can pinch that knee, and now he's not gonna be able to get up so easily, right? And now I'm gonna hang on with my elbow. I don't wanna just hang with my hand here. If I hang on to my elbow and he gets free, I, can, I still have that second layer of my wrist. So I wanna be as close as I can here, and I'm pinching that shoulder really tight. Now I have lots of attacks from here if I need to. I have, for instance, omoplatas, right, if you know that. If he tries to punch me, right, big punch, I have triangles here, I have straight arm bars here. Lots of, lots of attacks. I, of course, still can just create space, right? Let's go back into that real quick, right? I'm into this space, and I'm gonna be a little bit mean about how I create space, but I'm gonna dig and push here, okay? Create space, and now I can find my way out, okay?